All right, folks. Well, as you can see, I got the uh, tent set up there. Maybe y'all can see that. I forgot my cap here, but uh, I actually ran up on one that somebody left down here when they were fishing, so I'm using it. Uh, save my back a little bit. So what I'm about to do right here, sorry y'all, is I fixed to gather some of this pond water right here. Could I have brought water from the house, which ain't but, you know, four football fields away? Yeah, I could have. But remember, in SHTF, water filtration is going to be huge. Every sip of drink, every sip of water, or clean water, potable water we take, we're going to have to do three or four steps to it to get it, to get it that way. So i got my big 10-liter bag right here. I'm going to dip it in the pond. And then I think I'm going to hang it in a tree over there, and I'm going to dribble some of the pond water into this, and then we'll uh, run it through the sawyer, and then we'll boil it, okay? At least that is the plan. Oh, come on. Work it out. I had that thing stuck in my waistband. All right, here we go. Try not to fall, by the way. Let me scoot y'all over here you so you can see what I'm doing here. So if I fall, I guess we'll get it on camera. That ain't 10 liters, but it will do. Probably got two in there. The pond is actually down. We're so dry right now. The pond's actually a good ways down past the weeds. I'll show you that uh, on the next one. Anyhow, let me see if my tree limb's going to work. Let's spin you all around over here. Y'all, I can do what I need to do, but trying to film it is a pain in the rear end. Alright, move dog. Watch this plane not hold my picture right. It might be strong enough to hold that. Yeah, it looks like it. Okay. Oh now, don't fall off. You need sometimes you need four or five hands, y'all. That's why. Got our little Berkey bag filled up with pond water. I don't know. So that's 16 ounces, so I guess it's 16 ounces of water. Alright, let's get our, uh, let's spin you around. Spin around, go down. Oh, come on, stay. Alright. Excuse my rear end while I retrieve the filter here. Okay. Sorry you can't see my head. Take this off my uh, water, off my cup. That lid is made to press fit. Keep the dirt out of your cup. Screw this on to the Berkey. Make sure we got our flow arrow going in the right direction. All right, take this off and fill our cup right here. Okay. 
trying to do this where y'all can see it. I hope you can see it, y'all. Come on. Okay, detach. I'm gonna run over here and get one more little load. <coughs> Ain't no use blowing that out yet because I'm not done with it yet. Okay. Back over here to this bag. I think there's a little bit of water left in it. around sorry y'all all right this should top my cup all the way off blow arrow needs to go that way I don't think it'll go on but one way y'all I really don't continue filling my cup up all right Okay, that is a cup full of water. <coughs> Always blow your filter out, y'all. I'm gonna set it to water right here to let it air it out. Okay. Stay as sanitary as possible, which isn't always easy, y'all, in the outdoors. Okay, so there's my cup full of filtered pond water. We're now going to boil it. Get this, get that. Today, now I could have just a little louder and put my use my fat wood in there like I always do, y'all. Let me move it over here a little bit. But uh, I figure since we're filming, we might as well do a spark fire. Let me get myself set down right here. Doing this when you're old sucks, y'all. Let me, uh, y'all can't see. Dang it. Come here. Pull you a little closer. I apologize. Trying to get y'all where you can see what I'm doing here. Maybe. Okay. Okay, here's my solo stove. There's my cup with filtered water in it. Today for tender, for spark tender, I'm using jute twine. You can just uh, fuzzy it up here. It'll catch a spark. Okay, this has been a while since I've done this, y'all. This is why we have to get out here and practice. I can get the jute twine going and maybe I can throw it in there. Of 
There we go. Will it stay going? Nope. Of course it won't. Let me serve it up a little bit more. I'm sure I'm eating through some memory on this phone. Woohoo! Alright, let's try it again, y'all. Come on, come on, stay. There we go. Get in there and get my fat wood going. Yeah. Oh yeah, she's lit. Wipe my knife off here. It's high carbon, you have to make sure you keep it wiped off. Let this booger get a go in here. The uh the great thing about this stove, y'all, is uh you can just get you a handful of twigs. It doesn't really take a lot of firewood. And you can boil the water and do whatever, cook over a little skillet, do whatever you need to do. I may not have, uh, should have put so much wood in there at first. <laughs> I might not have should have done that. We'll get that going down on the bottom. Maybe not. Well, if I could just blew it out, it's all gone. Nope, she's still going. All right, I'm fixing to help it out. Where's my bit? It's going. It's it's doing its thing. I see it. She's fixing the fire off and get going here, y'all. So when my fire gets going, y'all, I will uh, bring y'all back, and uh, we'll boil some water. Let me see if I can pause this bad boy. Probably can't pause it. So well.